lie outside our seeing, beyond the beyond, at the edge of within. The Great Pyramid, erected by the Ancient Ones as a barricade at the portal between two dimensions, two separate realities. This is the story of one family drawn through a mysterious vortex into the other world and of their perilous trek homeward. of nearly unmapped territory in the ancient trail of obelisks that we hoped would lead us to Emar. We were riding in a mule-drawn wagon purchased from an old miner, and we felt like pioneers. But we were unprepared for the land around us. It was eerie and desolate. Nimula made us very much aware that we were lost in an alien world. Then suddenly everything changed, as though a line had been drawn across the desolation, and a beautiful forest began. Look, look at that. It's a forest. That's right, let's go. Fortunately, the skin isn't broken, but it's still going to take a while to heal. Oh, careful, you're going to hurt it. Yeah. Sometimes you have to hurt. Hurt to help. I know that, but the poor bird doesn't. He's so beautiful. 
Look at these feathers. They're made for silent flying. You know, I've always thought there must be a special joy in being something that has to fly to live. sure sounds spooky. Remember the night that possum was in your sleeping bag? <laughs> oh, the storms in this world are so weird. The Pyracorias. Fire Caesars. Whatever they're called. I've ever seen. I can't believe it. Oh, great. It's a dead end. Oh, I don't believe this. Ooh. I thought you knew where you were going. And turning two mules around in the middle of the road is not going to be the easiest thing I've ever done. So everybody just be quiet, please. Oh, oh, oh. They're frightened. Oh. didn't know. Who are you, anyway? What are you? King of the trees and lord of the animals. This is my domain. We mean you no harm. We're just travelers. You can't stop us from leaving. Ah. <laughs> Our king of the trees, just tell him to open up and we'll get out of here. That's all we want. I will let you live, you may go. But she must stay. I'm sorry. We're a family. We travel together. Stay where you are. Dad, no! Take him now. You must stay here with me or I'll kill them all. Then go ahead and kill us because we're not leaving without her. I won't harm you, but you must obey. If you love them, tell them to do what I have said. They cannot fight against me. Please let us go. I cannot. Do as he says. Take your father and get him some help. Mama, you can't stay here. Mom? Go. Just go before it's too late. We'll be back. I promise. <laughs> 